I'm Tara Saadi from Stellenbosch University. I have been driving a few research projects and trying to find adaption tools in the context of climate change in the agricultural sector. TerraClim is a tool that integrates multiple climate data sources into one integrated database. We've expanded this onto an online platform, the terraclim.ca.za. To date, that has not existed in the Western Cape. And then we transition that climate database of multiple points into climate maps of hourly, daily and monthly um, resolutions. And then we take that and transition it into climatic indexes, which links to specific crop types that can aid decision making in field over multiple seasons. We take terrain information and we integrate that with climatic data points. You have a weather station in your farm, so we take slope, solar radiation, elevation aspect into consideration and we map your farm. So you can have a weather station on a morning sunspot and through the mapping you end up getting insights as to where the afternoon sunspots, where the high areas of solar radiation that has a direct impact on your water use and your plants, your plant expression throughout the season, which areas will need to be harvested earlier, later, based on the climatic profiling. But how does it compare to the last five seasons to the long term? So we can start identifying where the trends have changed and how should you adapt based on your localised shifts in seasons. Dericlim is um, shifting into developing a suitability tool which can help you as a decision maker identify what you should plant where based on the terrain, the soil, the water availability as well as the climatic profiling. You can start doing what we call machine learning which is high-end back-end analysis which links your crop responses with your climatic profiling and that changes your management strategy at a larger scope. Terraclim is focusing a lot at the moment in tailoring the product to specific agricultural crops so the sky is really the limit and where climate is really an underpinning and drives every agricultural response is better to understand what we're working with and that's the only way that we can mitigate change.